talk to you about the Bears because the Chicago fans, they're some of the best fans in the world. You're on 85, huh? Part, oh, yeah. Part uh, nine. 85 Bears were great. They're I mean, just – and the funny thing is about the Bears is when I came there, they they had a good year. I think they made it to the playoffs, but they had just released Urlacher, so there was a right, lot right. of tension. Yeah, yeah. Um, but it's still like no matter how the Bears do, it's like last year was the 85 Bears. Right. And this exactly. year we're going back to right, the Super exactly. Bowl. Yeah, you know. Well, until until that happens again, I think the '85 Bears will be revered because think about it, guys. The, totally, the, man. The city hadn't won a championship in almost 60 years. Yeah, since 1960 or whatever. Yes. So the '85 Bears came, and Chicago was always known as a second city. You know, and people thought, oh, well, there's New York, there's LA, right, right. oh, there's Dallas, no, oh, Chicago somewhere. But so we sort of embottle what championships were made of and we brought the interest of the entire world yeah. I mean we did the Super Bowl shuffle which is a video yeah, I helped produce yesterday. Right, exactly. yesterday. yeah and uh, I helped produce and direct that and write that and Hell so yeah, we, we became like the folk hero around the world yeah. so people the interest of the NFL grew I think by 30 or 40 percent that year and so we also helped save football that year because we really brought cool. life back into the league. It was you amazing. Got, um, maybe you saw the refrigerator made a touchdown. Oh, yeah. yeah. The fridge. <laughs> the fridge. Yeah, oh, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. The fridge. He was-